we're gonna be going over the brand new update for PlayStation Home today. Uh, I'm amazed. I got on PlayStation Home, didn't have to do a single update, and it is running games like uh, the games that you normally would play. Pay what, forty, sixty dollars for in a uh, GameStop? They're running those type of games. Quality is just out there. And guess what? It's given to us for free. Uh oh. Stop it. Stop that shit. Stop, motherfucker. Fuck! This, this shit is just, is, is, it's just fucking amazing, as you can see. Um, yeah, of course, like I've said in past videos. Oh, wow, he threw fucking fire at me. In past videos, I said, if you, uh, get high scores in games, you will get close. I got a high, the highest kill death. Stay still, motherfucker. There you go. Yeah, so, I don't know. They gave me an item, but I haven't left the game. Because, uh, actually, this is pretty addictive. It's a first-person shooter, and... Yes, you can team up with friends, and it has a lobby. I believe it's... I believe it's three-on-three. Three. It has a shotgun. It has a rifle. Um, of course, you saw the Tommy gun. This is based on a night in 1929. So it's gonna have those type of weapons, of course. We got a revolver that everybody starts out with. Um, got him. Some people probably won't be accustomed to the controls, but if you've been playing first-person shooters for a long time and you're, you know, you, you got you. If he's gonna keep spawning right here. Which is the scene of the cops getting in here. Well, I think that's the bootlegger's car. So that must be their spawn point. And yeah. Let's see where I, I spawn at. Yeah, I spawn over here where the cops at. Yeah, you could tell how old the time is set in. I, I think it's amazing. I really do. Fuck, I didn't get that last bullet in him. Oh, it's, it's me versus two other people. I believe it was three on three, but the first when I first started out. It was a lot of people in here. Maybe four on four, maybe five on five. I don't know. Still pretty. F Damn. I'm getting fucked up. I still almost got more points than the top player over there, which I couldn't see. God damn. The aiming is a little bit off, but hey. It's not that bad, actually. It might just be me. <laughs> oh. I already know what I'm about to do with these guys. They can't hear me. That's the funny thing. I'll be right behind them and they won't even know. I was about to die anyway. Fuck that shit. I got 900. Uh, the lead play on the other team got 900. Like I said, if you play first person shooters for a long time, you can still handle the controls. Uh, but you might have to change the uh, in game PlayStation Home controls. Who the fuck is shooting me, man? I can't, I can't even see who the fuck was Oh, really, man? I couldn't even see. I didn't know who was shooting me, though. They might have been shooting me through one of the cracks like I did those motherfuckers. Oof. Oh, I'm gonna find you. Oof. Damn! 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 Damn, man! Oh! I should have fucking reload. I'm not supposed to be doing a commentary. Well, I'll just let you guys know. If I'm playing a game like this, I'm... They tear my ass up and there's nothing I can fucking do about it. Damn! 
Damn, it's two on one with I know they won. I'm about to leave out of this game. Wow. Okay, so uh did that take long? Hell yeah it did. We gotta hurry up and try to get to the rest of the stuff. The, as you can see, this is a very hot spot right here. This is a free pl first person shooter. Uh, you see a guy from Battlefield here. He has the Battlefield outfit, which means yeah, he actually has Battlefield. And um, everybody's here, man. And this is just one of the brand new spots. We're gonna go um, to the other new spot. Uh, I like the RC, the RC Racer. Now the RC racer spot, you can customize your own car. It's gonna save, you know, it's good you're gonna be able to save that memory of how your car looks, uh the wheels, the um the body, the color, and you can race it. The physics on the racing on this are amazing. It bounces when you, you jump and, and it it's it's amazing. It's amazing. The li the lighting on uh, PlayStation Home, I don't, I don't know what engine it's running on, but there are some games sold to us that don't even have lighting like PlayStation Home. It's not almost not even the same quality of PlayStation Home, and I do mean lower quality. And uh, I'm just saying, I'm, I'm impressed. I'm impressed from me up here waiting for it all the way in 2008 to me being able to play it the way I'm playing it right now is just amazing this is RC rally I've saw people um, running around with RC rally uh, leather uh, jacket black white and red as you can see by the primary colors of the logo uh, this is RC rally right here I'm actually playing it so I got I came to the other spot hop right into a fucking game um, th is, this is this is nice right this, uh, this is, isn't a PSN game. This is PlayStation Home. PlayStation Home is now running uh, game engines. Like, it has its own engine. And it can run games. Like, it has Texas Hold'em and the sports area. And we gotta go there, too. I'm very impressed. And every time you get a high score on these games, you get, you get uh, in-game trophies. Like, shirts or gloves or hats or something for your apartment I mean it's, it's pretty nice now they also have quests for this new update of PlayStation Home you can do different quests which mean if you go here and get a high score um you know they, they get oh fuck oh fuck I fucked up over there ah that was me yeah they they give you some I mean I think it's that I think it's epic man I never lost faith in PlayStation Home, although some people never found an interest, but I'm glad I, I'm a big supporter of PlayStation Home and see how far it is coming now. It, it makes me feel proud. Okay, you have received a new item. You see that? Do, do you not see that right there? I mean, all you have to do is just play. I mean, it's for free. You're getting this shit for free. There's no trick like, you know, Xbox Live where they're, they're tricking you. Oh, you get to do this and this other stuff. There's no tricks. There we go. Got the RC jacket. Just by getting a good time. Oh, God. I don't know what to say. We're going to go over some more stuff. We're going to go to the sports area real quick. And then we're going to go to the park. So, um, actually, we're just going to go to the park since it was right there. The sports area and the park have been both uploaded and approved by me. I've, I've been to both places because I wanted to check it out just to make sure. Everything is running smoothly. Now, as you can see, to a certain degree, it might take a tad bit of, uh, long to load up. But that's only uh, because it's the early part of today, first of all. I'm probably gonna do a part two to this video and uh, the other thing about this is there are so many people on PlayStation home a lot of people have been waiting for an update now I'm not I don't want to say this is update 2.0 but it feels like it because it's it's so new everything is just so different 
Now, I've talked to you about the lighting and the day and night that Forza Motorsport 4, 3, 2, and the original Motorsport couldn't do. Um, home can do it. Home has b beautiful textures. Just check out the textures on that turkey statue up there. I mean, it's just amazing. Look at all these turkeys we have in the same area as other people that are about to start popping in. You know, they do have to pop in the textures for other people that are online. But when they do it, it's, it all looks beautiful. You got turkeys running around. And then you got people on a Ferris wheel while it's going around and around. You got the video playing over there. And it, it it's it's just amazing. So, um, let's go check out the Ferris wheel. Hopefully I get on a red one. Is it a red one? Oh, I think it's red. Oh, you can also invite people to your Ferris wheel to sit beside you or whatever. I think it's it's cool. It actually goes around. You're actually seeing how high it goes, how low it goes, what's below us. I mean, it's an island over there. It's just... Oh, oh wow. The person actually came and sat beside me. This is just cool. This This is what I'm talking about. I'm I'm just I'm about to have a nerdgasm, man. Seriously. Seriously. I this is what I've been waiting for for gaming to get this far. And it's actually gotten this far, man. They have um portals that will direct you to certain spots that you want. Uh let me just put it this way. There's the RC racer you saw I was in this area uh going here on the the remote control will teleport you to that area the textures the lighting from the shadow of the sunset uh from the ferris wheel on this wall and, and going across me is just i thought that was amazing that reminded me a lot of uncharted this girl is wearing the laura croft outfit that is pretty cool i mean it's a gamer's paradise playstation home it really is i think she tried to go in there oh this is the um the gate to the sports area let's see how much time we got we got enough time to check out the sports area and if if we have enough time to do something else we will but uh what I'm probably gonna do is uh the movie area and uh, the hub the first area you start out in I'm probably gonna put that in one video and then go over some other stuff but after we check out this uh, sports area, we're probably going to end this video. I don't want it to drag on too long. I do have a lot of stuff that I've done today. and I'm Okay, so this is the sports area. It's basically a sports bar equipped with a news ticker up there. We got uh, poker tables around here. Okay, then we have a poker club over here where you can play Texas Hold'em. Um, you have live sports feeds. The the, the sport the sports club is equipped with sports things like these skateboards on the wall. Amazing! I I am amazed by the detail. You know how hard it is for game developers to put little things like skateboard or a cup of water or food or a half eaten sandwich or something like that in their games, and for PlayStation Home to be all about that, it's amazing. It's amazing. Um, you got baseballs over here. You know, you can turn your head and see it's three-dimensional. It's not flat of different uh, sports players that they've signed. I think it's just amazing. Pictures of boxers and other stuff up there. Snowboards on the wall. Uh, hockey tape um, helmets. Then over, when you go over here, you got the home sports trivia challenge where you get to answer questions about real sports stars, real uh, sports superstars, all types of sports you get to answer your questions you know and show how pe how 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 much knowledge you know past here it uh is a football stadium i'm not sure if it's this this big gate is ever going to be open so we can go over there but um this is just amazing i am amazed i'm i'm not sure if you guys are amazed but i'm amazed at, at what's happening so far oh we got a sports sticker over here then we got uh feeds video feeds over here brought to you by uh cbs so far i saw i saw their logo i've also saw uh espn we got little um uh sports stars like a golf player right there football player here basketball player here baseball player right there and right here we got a hockey player amazing Amazing, covering all really sports from pro to college. Um, I haven't saw any high school. It's, I I, I can't say anymore, man. It, this this is epic. <laughs>